Welcome to Wayne State University's Department of English. I am Roy Ann Smith, Department of English undergraduate advisor and an alum. I would like to take a few minutes to share some of the exciting opportunities that a degree in English has to offer. When you hear the words English studies, what do you think of? A bunch of people sitting in a classroom discussing books, right? Well, English studies encompasses far more than this. Here are just a few areas of focus that English majors study. We study creative writing. We study literature and culture. We become expert information gatherers and researchers. We study media, film, and new media. And we study professional writing. Whether you focus on one area of study or take a taste of each, all English majors acquire these core skills and knowledge areas. Written communication, critical thinking, verbal communication, collaboration, problem solving, creativity and innovation, technological competence and literacy, ethics, diversity, equity, and inclusivity, global understanding, and leadership. Armed with these math skills and a broad knowledge base, what do English majors do after earning their BAs? Looking at the data from the last US Census can give us a clue. Note the area of education. It's only 21% of the pie, and this includes not only teachers and professionals, but from early childhood through graduate programs, but librarians, trainers for private businesses and organizations. Instead, if we combine management, finance, sales, and administrative occupations, nearly half find careers in business and organizations. Others may continue on to be lawyers, pharmacists, physicians, etc. Notably for Wayne State, I think we can safely assume that the percentage going into healthcare is higher than the 3% shown here. Now that we've covered what English majors do once they have finished their BA programs, what are some opportunities for our students while they're working on their undergraduate pathways? Well, to start, we have a really flexible curriculum. Our major is 12 classes, half of which are English electives. That makes for very easy scheduling when you are combining second programs, pre-professional programs, and your general education program. We also offer a lot of scholarships. These are exclusive to our English majors, and some of our scholarships offer up to ten dollars or $12,000 a year. We encourage our majors to participate in internships. Some of those internships could include tutoring at various levels, professional writing, where you would write PR for businesses or organizations, or even do social media marketing for them, or you could even work in a law office. We participate in undergraduate research from the departmental level all the way through the university level. Notably, we participate in the faculty student mentoring program, and we also host the humanities area of the Warrior Undergraduate Research Conference every year. We also offer well eligible students an accelerated master's program called A grade. In this program, seniors with excellent GPAs could potentially earn up to half of their master's credits while they're doing their undergraduate coursework. We have a lot of award earning faculty all the way from graduate teaching assistantships to our full professors. That includes from the local levels all the way through the international levels. We also have an English honors program. That is a BA program where students have the opportunity to work one-on-one -on -one with faculty mentors. And also at the end of their career as a BA student, their diploma comes out with English honors stamped on it. We participate in num a number of student organizations. We have reading groups, we have creative writing groups, we have film and media groups, and even a comic book collective group. 
We consider our entire department one big learning community, but we also participate in several of the university's learning communities from composition all the way through popular culture. We pride ourselves on being a department with a small college feel within a big university. You get to learn to know your professors and your student peers very well. Those are just some of the reasons that students enjoy our classes and curriculum. To learn more, listen to this enthusiastic endorsement from English major Amal Ross. My name is Amal Ross. I'm an English major and I'm a junior. Why I chose to study English at Wayne State was because I felt that the faculty was very personable. Before I decided to go to Wayne State, I spoke with the English advisor, Roy Yan, and she was so helpful. She gave really great advice, and it was just such a positive experience, and I knew that I wanted to continue studying here at Wayne State. Studying English is the study of literature, and with literature, you're studying history, you're studying people, cultures. I mean, it's such a broad scope. You're able to narrow it, but also it's just, it's taking you to different time periods if you're gonna study fiction or, um, different social movements through literature. Well, I'm interested in English because I'm very nerdy and I like to read and write. I also like that I'm able to um, take classes in creative writing here. So I'm able to access that creative side instead of everything just being analytical and other classes and other aspects of my life. So that's very nice. I also really value the intellectual discussions that arise in various English classes. We're able to talk about like social issues, history, different things that I don't think you would necessarily have to talk about in other classes. Um, my advice to someone who's considering to study English but they're not sure yet would be to look at the different classes that are offered within the English major. There are the required courses and the elective courses and in the elective courses there are just so many different things that you could study where you could like look at rhetoric writing or creative writing or different kinds of poetry and just it's so many different things that you could do. So I think looking at that and seeing where your interests are, I've met a lot of English majors who have very different tracks, you know, like for their careers, um, people who want to go into medicine, people who want to go into teaching. It's not a one size fits all major, but there's something for everyone. So the professors and faculty here are just so great. I haven't had a not good experience with any one of them. A lot of the professors are really open and just, they want to talk to their students. They love it when you go talk to them. It's nice being able to, further my what I get out of the class from outside of just the classroom setting and the professors make that easy to do. Studying English in Detroit has been great. I think it's being here has also been enriching because um, a lot of my professors incorporate Detroit into our curriculum. There was one Detroit poet who my English professor my freshman year took us to see. Um, his name is Jamal May. He's so great. And he's actually, uh, right now, this year, he's a um, visiting lecturer or professor here. So it's really awesome because I got to see him or hear him uh, share his work my freshman year and then my junior year I was able to take a class with him, which was totally awesome. It was great. And yeah, he's a Detroit native poet. Thank you for joining me today for the Wayne State Department of English Open House presentation. Don't hesitate to request more information from our website at english.wayne.edu or by emailing either Professor Goodrich, our Director of Undergraduate Studies, or me, Royanne, using the email addresses at the bottom of the screen. Enjoy your day.